part, do you want to talk about how it's impacted the way in which we've expanded our network, especially in the pandemic? Yeah. So yes, the next one we want to talk about is our podcast has helped us meet cool new people um, and get exposed to their audiences. And it's also brought in business. So, you know, a lot of people get hung up on the vanity metrics. You know, how many subscribers? What's my rating on iTunes? Uh, you know, how many people are listening to it? Great, those things mm. do matter. But what we've learned is that's not the be all and end all, right? Like it's who you're meeting, the quality of your guests, having gr a great rapport with them and then them promoting your podcast. Um, all of that has been so, so amazing. And also yes. I was part of your part of this more emotionally intelligent way of measuring ROI is you have to enjoy it. So I think right now what we've gone through the past year and or so, you know, just basing things on numbers, I think is going to be, it's antiquated. There's got to be an emotional element to it. And there's got to be a people element to it. Um, evaluate and, and measure your podcast success based on that. Mm -hmm.